Oh my gosh, I just brewed this cold brew in my Alta home kit and I have no idea how to check if it's consistent or not. Did someone say consistent? Oh my gosh, it's the consistent man himself, Mr. Arthur. What did you bring here? What is, what is this? This is our TDS meter Used to help you check consistency throughout your batches and to see how strong your brew is. That's amazing. That's amazing Okay, walk me through how does one use a TDS meter super simple so take it out Get your little it's piper peeper <laughs> It's definitely not peeper <laughs> Okay, go ahead keep going. All right super simple <laughs> Press the read button to turn it on. Nice. Just Some people like say that. red as well. No, this in this instance, it's read. Okay. It's context. Okay. Come on. Open your cold brew. Oh, it's so strong. Yes. Get your little, little dripper, yeah. dripper dropper. Peeper, if you will. Peeper, if you will. And drop it on in. Does it matter how much? Nope. Okay. Just enough. Go ahead and close it. Okay. And then press read. How'd I do? Buddy. 1.2. You need a range of 1.6 to 2.2. Oh my gosh, so what did I do wrong? You might have not used enough coffee or maybe you need to brew it for a little bit longer. Okay. But either way, if it tastes good to you, then it's good. Yeah, but I mean, now that I know that it's a 1.2, I'm not gonna serve this to my customers. No. I'm gonna do maybe. it right. Yeah, just do the TDS that you normally would do and uh... So you can do this for, obviously this is in the home kit and we sell the commercial size as well. Does this work for the commercial? Yep, works for commercial, home brewing, any way you want to check consistency throughout your batches. And I know this is not something that I normally would drink because I'm just not like that, but could we also use it for hot coffee? Yeah, you can use it for hot coffee and cold brew, I like. Ooh. Now the TDS ranges are a little bit different for hot coffee and cold brew. Oh my but... gosh, look at him, he's just spouting facts, it's so, <laughs> so, <laughs> so much confidence in it, but yeah. So uh, there's a difference between hot and cold in the TDS? Yeah, a TDS for a hot coffee, 1.2, that'd be pretty good. Okay. But for cold brew, it's different. I heard that Alto is releasing a cold brew cupping protocol pretty soon. Yep. Keep your eyes out for that. Ooh, I heard Mr. Consistent himself had a huge hand in making that, so yeah, I'm too. <laughs> Go ahead and grab the TDS meter. The TDS meter is gonna be online. It retails at $229. We priced it that way, so that way you can get your hands on it at not too much of a cost. We think that this is really gonna change the way that you brew, either at home or in the shop. This is just something that we believe coffee is only as good as what you can do consistently, and this is the way to do it. Mr. Consistent. Mr. Consistent is just going off the cover. <laughs> okay, I don't even know what he's doing right now. The shoot is over. Thank you so much, Mr. Consistent. I appreciate it. You are the man.